You talk about just how infectious this uh, particular variant is. And a pathologist at a Texas children's hospital said that Omicron has now, quote, reached a level in terms of contagiousness that is now in the same category of measles, which is one of the most highly transmissible viruses. Does a former drill sergeant make a terrible therapist? You've heard the warnings. Don't touch your face in the age of COVID-19, but it's not so easy. So people are coming up with some creative ways to stop. The average person touches their face 23 times every hour. So you can see why keeping your hands away from your eyes, nose and mouth is absolutely essential during the pandemic. And that's why yellow makes me sad, I think. I'd like you to let go of all concern. That's interesting. Now, some of us are resorting to hypnotherapy to break the habit, just like smoking or biting your nails. That's interesting. You notice any urge to touch your face. And suddenly, your arms and hands feel very heavy. You know what makes me sad? You do! Hypnotist John Monjovi says his business is booming as the surge in COVID-19 cases sweeps America. Can you hypnotize someone to stop touching their face? You can hypnotize someone to reduce the number of self-touch gestures and increase their awareness of the desire to touch the face. Maybe we should chug on over to Mamby Pamby land where maybe we can find some self-confidence for you, you jack wagon. If you do have to touch your face, use a clean tissue. Tissue? Right, baby. Geico, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more.